How's it going, my starling friends? I wanted to make this quick video to address a question that I get from a lot of you guys. Namely, when will Starlink be portable? That is not geo-restricted so that I could take this Starlink dish and use it in my RV or just somewhere that it's not assigned to my cell with my service address. Well, we're closer to knowing that answer. Three, two, one, zero. Ignition, lift off. A lot of you have been asking me this question in various videos and just recently Michael asked me, I just want to know when I'll be able to take it from one location to another, not necessarily on a moving vehicle, but stationary at one address and then I'm going on vacation. So I want to take it with me to another address and in another state. Well, Michael, your movable satellite internet may be coming sooner than you think. A great success! SpaceX plans to lift that geo restriction on Starlink dishes later this year. So once this is lifted, you'll be able to use your Starlink dish from any location, including in a moving RV. And this is all according to Elon Musk. When exactly? Well, sometime later this year. Obviously, that's not very conclusive, but at least it is good news for those of you who are itching to use this in more than just your home. Take a look at this tweet. Elon Musk says, yeah, should be fully mobile later this year so you can move it anywhere or use it on an RV or truck in motion. So I know that this is so exciting for so many of you. As you know, right now, SpaceX geo restricts the satellite dish to the subscribers, registered residence, home address, whatever that is. So in the meantime, beam them up. Elon says that they definitely need a few more satellite launches to achieve complete coverage and some key software upgrades. So I want you to comment below where you want to use your dishy. Of course, other than your registered service address, where would you want to take it? Comment below. I love reading your comments. Also in Elon Twitter news, when will Starlink exit its beta phase? Well, according to Elon, probably sometime this summer. So far, over 10,000 people in countries all over the world have been able to sign up and use the beta service. But of course, when it's done with this beta or test phase, even more of you will be allowed to join. And I know that so many of you really want to get Starlink for yourselves. In fact, I conducted a quick poll and according to almost 100 votes, many of you are still waiting to get your hands on Starlink. So definitely crossing my fingers that it comes to a latitude near you very soon. And again, if you're new to the channel, please hit subscribe. I am constantly keeping you in the loop of Starlink news and I appreciate all of the support. Until then, see you soon.